Hey, Fantasy, I have a package that has to go out right away, okay? I just got here. Give me a chance to get on the clock. I'm not that fat. <laughs> That's not what we heard. Who was that man who just got out of your car? You can smell him a mile away. What do you care, Mr. John B. Amuli, dictator? At least I didn't name my son Mussolini after that jerk. That's telling him, sister girl. He's just mad because you won't date him. Uh, at least I don't go around dating homeless men. Uh. <laughs> You're one to talk, John. In the future, at those third stone postal barbecues at the beach, stop putting those beef knockwurst in your bathing suit. Even the female dogs were barking at you. Rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come over here. I'll show you my knockwurst. That'll shut him up. Good job, girl. Hey, Fantasy, why is it that you date homeless men at that soup line? Because when the date is all said and done, I could drop them off anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, that's just Bill. Bill? Who the hell is Bill? Bill Konarski. He used to have a radio show, but I think he's fallen on hard times. I heard of Bill, who has a best friend in a wheelchair, but at the time Bill was with his friend, he had a heart attack and died, see, while with him. And Bill tried to cash his check while he was dead and told the people in the check cashing place he was sleeping with a hangover. I hope it's not that, Bill. Okay, see you soon, girl. Hey, hey, what about the face value money? Mister, come back here. You have to scan the package with the machine before you give it to me for delivery, supervisor. I mean, supervisor Hank. <laughs> Don't you think I know that local? I've been done did that. What did you say, Mr. Hank? I've been done did that. And you talk about locals English? Jeez. What the country coming to when I speak English better than you? And you were born here. Shut up, local, before I put you on report. You can't even spell report. I hate you get your nephew to write up all your reports. That's why he's sending you, Fantasy, to deliver a package for him. His nephew's a rapper. What kind of a rapper? Okay, couriers, enough of these questions about my nephew. If you must know, he's a stripper rapper. Now everybody has to deliver the parcel. <laughs> I have a package from your uncle. I know you. My uncle told me all about you, Fantasy. I would like to invite you in, but I don't want to ruin your fig. Oh, you're a nasty boy, but I have to go. Oh, wait. I want an opinion on a new rap song I have. Oh, your third stone post office is the place the government ought to know. Fantasy's the baddest bitch. Oh, yeah, she's good to go. Local who's the crazy, silly as hell. But Mr. Falk has the strangest name that we all want to yell. Hot ass dot, she just won't stop breaking all the barriers. T-S-P-O? What you need to know? The hell with the other curry ass. So what do you think? I'll get back to you, big boy. I have to go.